But you want to know what else is on the wane? Empathy. A study of over 15,000 college students found that today's students are 40% less empathetic than those in the past. Today's students are 40% less likely to identify with statements like, I sometimes try to understand my friends better by imagining how things look from their perspective. They are 40% less likely to identify with, I often have tender, concerned feelings for people less fortunate than me. What's the connection? Well, I've spent the past two decades in the classroom reading readers. And what I passionately believe, and what the emerging field of literary neuroscience is beginning to prove, is that reading literature makes us more empathetic. Are we sympathetic or frustrated with Hamlet when he delays avenging his father's death? When Jane Eyre learns Mr. Mr. Rochester is already married? Do we urge her to flee Thornfield or to stay? What we're doing when we're thinking through protagonist's actions is we're judging them against what we would do in the same situation or what we have done in the past. We practice making decisions that have consequences, which is to say we practice adulting. The mind reading we do when thinking through a character educates our emotional intelligence. And this was proven in a study called the Reading the Mind in the Eyes test. This study took participants and gave them photographs cropped to reveal only a subject's eyes, and then gave them four options to choose what emotion that person was feeling. Now, we're actually going to try that here today, and I'm going to ask for a show of hands. And the rules are like this. Everyone has to vote for one of the four options, and anyone who's caught not voting will be invited on stage to do interpretive dance. <laughs> okay, are you ready? What is this man feeling? Raise your hand for terrified. Raise your hand for upset. Raise your hand for arrogant. Raise your hand for annoyed. This man is upset. We're going to try one more now that you've got the hang of it. Look at his eyes. What is this man feeling? Everyone has to vote. Raise your hand for joking. Raise your hand for insisting. Raise your hand for amused. Raise your hand for relaxed. This man is insisting. If you got both of those right, raise your hand and keep it raised for a second. Everybody turn to look at those people. Statistically speaking, it's likely they are better readers than you are. Regular readers score higher on the reading the mind in the eyes test because it's theorized reading allows us practice taking on another person's perspective. It's funny, but we have this stereotype of the bookworm as this paste-eating, socially awkward loner. But reading improves our social awareness. Reading literature helps us read the room.